Welcome to Global Defense News and Analysis. Today, we bring you insights on China's latest military advancement, the Z-20 helicopter, which is garnering significant attention for its potential impact on naval operations, particularly in anti-submarine warfare. The Z-20, which was recently displayed at the China International Aviation and Aerospace Exhibition in Zhuhai, on November 12, 2024, is a state-of-the-art helicopter that shares striking similarities with the U.S. UH-60 Black Hawk in terms of its sleek design and operational capabilities. While its overall performance as a military asset is noteworthy, analysts believe its true strength lies in its role within China's growing naval forces. The Z-20 could become a game-changer, particularly in the context of China's need to strengthen its defenses against submarine threats. One of the key features of the Z-20 is its advanced anti-submarine warfare, ASW, capabilities. For years, China's naval forces have struggled with effective anti-submarine defense, particularly as it continues to expand its fleet of advanced warships and aircraft carriers. Many of its rivals have already perfected the art of underwater warfare, making it critical for China to bridge this gap. The Z-20F, the naval variant of the helicopter, is expected to provide significant improvements in this area, offering an enhanced ability to detect, track, and neutralize submarine threats. As the Z-20F enters the picture, it is expected to address the limitations posed by China's older naval helicopters. The Z-8 and Z-9, which were based on European designs from the 1980s, have proven to be inefficient for the demands of modern naval operations. The Z-8 is too heavy and the Z-9 is too light, limiting their payloads, range, and sensor capabilities. These helicopters, now outdated, often struggle to operate from the variety of ships in China's naval fleet. In contrast, the Z-20F is seen as the solution to these issues, with analysts predicting that it will soon become the standard helicopter for China's naval operations, particularly for ASW missions. The Z-20F's design allows it to operate from a range of naval vessels, including smaller ships like corvettes and larger ships like destroyers and aircraft carriers. This versatility is a crucial asset as it allows China's Navy to deploy the helicopter across a wide variety of operational scenarios. The Z-20F's development has been closely watched by defense experts as it promises to significantly extend the operational range of Chinese warships in ASW operations. In fact, some experts claim that the Z-20F could more than double the range of existing helicopters in China's fleet, making it a powerful tool in countering submarine threats. The Z-20F's capabilities have drawn comparisons to similar helicopters used by other navies around the world, particularly, uh, particularly the U.S. Navy's S-60 and MH-60R helicopters. According to a Pentagon report, the Z-20F is expected to offer significant improvements over these Western models, particularly in terms of its payload capacity, sensor suite, and operational range. The Z-20F will likely allow China's naval forces to conduct ASW operations at greater distances from their host ships, a critical factor when dealing with enemy submarines that often operate far beneath the surface. In terms of operational tactics, the Z-20F is expected to follow modern anti-submarine strategies that involve helicopters operating at extended ranges from their host ships. This allows them to detect and track enemy submarines using advanced sensors, often coordinating with other ships and aircraft to engage the enemy. The Z-20F, like many of its counterparts, will also carry lightweight weapons such as depth charges and torpedoes, which can be used to neutralize submarine threats. While helicopters typically do not perform the final strike, their role in tracking and guiding other platforms to the target is invaluable. While the Z-20 is already in limited service for search and rescue operations, the recent display of its armed and naval variants signals China's intent to expand the helicopter's role in military operations. In addition to the Z-20F, analysts expect further iterations of the helicopter to be developed, with specialized versions designed to tackle specific threats such as airborne targets or even ground assaults. The growing versatility of the Z-20 suggests that it will play an increasingly significant role in China's military modernization efforts. In conclusion, 
the Z-20 helicopter is set to be a cornerstone of China's anti-submarine capabilities, filling a critical gap in the naval fleet's ability to defend against submarine threats. As China's military continues to modernize, the Z-20F represents a significant leap forward in ensuring the protection of its warships, including its aircraft carriers, in the increasingly contested waters of the Asia-Pacific region. Thank you for tuning in to Global Defense News and Analysis. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell icon, and share this video with others who may find this analysis insightful. Thank you for listening, and we look forward to bringing you more updates on the world of defense.